Hello everyone, today we are going to see matrix multiplication. Yet if we have matrix A and B, then product AB is given by the matrix C. When this product is defined, then matrix A is said to be conformable or compatible to the matrix B for a multiplication. Now what we have here, we have matrix A of order M by P. And matrix B of order this P by N. Now we know that what does this order represent? This M represent number of rows of matrix A. And these are the columns of matrix A. Similarly here rows of B. And this is columns of matrix B. Now the product AB is defined when we have number of columns is equals to number of rows of second matrix right and the product order is given by this remaining yum and yum so what is the order of this matrix a b this is M by N. So, product AB is possible when this what? Columns of A is equals to rows of B. Only then product AB is defined. Okay. So, what is here? When we have the columns of A is equals to the rows of B. In that case only product AB is defined or product AB is possible. Now we can check this is here. If we have matrix A, let this matrix A is of order 2 by 3 and then compatible order of B let this is here 3 by 1. So, check here we have number of columns of A is equals to the number of rows. Right. So, product AB is defined. And what is the order of this AB then? This remaining 2 by 1. Similarly, if we take another matrix of order, this is 3 by 4. And if we take here 4 by 2. Now check that here. This is columns of A is equals to rows of B. Then product AB is possible and remaining order will be this 3 by 2. Similarly we can check here by taking if we have this is 1 by 3 matrix A and this is here 3 by 1. So what is here? This columns of A is equals to the rows of B. Then AB is defined and product is remaining this 1 by 1. So AB is order 1 by 1. So we can check this is by taking examples. Here we have to check whether this matrix multiplication AB is possible or not. So here we have matrix of order 2 by 3. And matrix B of order 3 by 1. So we have to check here number of columns of A and number of rows of B. So here we have columns of A is equals to rows of B. So this AB is defined. And what will be the order of AB? So AB order will be here. This remaining this 2 and this 1. So AB order 2 by 1. So next here we have matrix X and Y. We have to check XY is possible or not. So X is of order 2 by 2. And Y is of order. This how many rows here? 2 rows and 3 columns. So we have to check this number of 
columns of this x and this is number of rows is it number of rows of y this is what columns of x is equals to rows of y here so this is x y is defined and what is the order of this x y this is what remaining this 2 by 3 similarly next here we have to check y x multiplication is possible or not so first we will write order here y x order this is 2 by 3 and here we have x order this is 2 by 2 so we have to check this columns of y and rows of x this is our y matrix and this is x right so this is here columns of y is not equals to rows of x so columns of y is not equals to rows of x so this is y x is not defined that means product y x is not possible here so what we have seen here when here for matrix x and y this x y is possible this x y is possible but that doesn't implies that y x is also possible so why y x is not possible here because columns of y is not equals to the rows of x so we have seen here for a matrix multiplication matrix multiplication is possible only when columns of first matrix is equal to the rows of second matrix here we don't have columns of y and rows of x equal so this is why x is not defined so this is all about matrix multiplication so what we have seen matrix multiplication a b is possible only when columns of a is equals to the rows of b so this is matrix multiplication thank you